Hey what's up Sky Squad, Sky here today and today I'm back with another video but today is not gonna be an ordinary video but oh uh, god I said it again I said it again guys I literally just said it again okay anyways if you are new to this channel my name is Sky and today and um basically what I do here is I make vid um, videos like any other youtuber and um, I stopped doing gaming videos um, earlier on if you watch my earlier videos and also if you are new to this channel I would suggest you first go ahead and watch my first two videos which is the welcome to my channel and the 13 facts about me but if you are new to this channel um, so that you, you watch those two videos so that you get to know me better but I suggest you um, if you are new to this channel go ahead and click that subscribe button and turn on notifications for week, uh, weekendly posts I don't know if weekendly is a thing but anyways yes turn on notifications and if you have subscribed turned on um, notifications and like this video I will um, comment down below hashtag sky squad both s's with a um, capital and uh, capital and I shall try and give you a post notification shout out in my next video so anyways let's get straight into the video so today I am going to be talking about how I record my screen so basically I'm guessing some of you have already guessed and some of you all already know but I use QuickTime player for my screen recordings so basically what I do for QuickTime player is I, I personally keep it in my desktop so I bring it here I mean I put it in my um, mini bar over here so I right click on it which if you don't know what a right click is is like you use both your two fingers and you click on something like that okay so you right click onto QuickTime player and you get three options so there's a movie recording there's an audio recording and a screen recording so I've already done a screen recording because I'm recording my screen right now so if you want to record your screen you click screen recording and it should say over here like over here somewhere over here click to, to start your recording so you click you double click and once this goes black like this this color okay you that shows that you are recording okay so doing a screen recording also means that you're already doing an audio recording it's just that when you do an audio recording you get a chance to if you have a internal I mean if you have a microphone you can choose that or you can use some other app that you have so I'm not gonna do an audio recording because I just personally don't want to but anyways if you want to stop your screen recording you go into here and you click stop the screen record and you click this button and that will stop the screen recording so I'm not gonna do that because I still have more to say in this video but you will click that button to stop recording and that will mean that your screen recording has finished and then your your um your recording will then come somewhere over here and then you will be able to um click the the black uh, right um, red button and that would also give you a um uh what's it called option to rename your um your fo your new file and also save it or not save it so you could do that and that is basically your screen recording now for how to do a face cam so face cam isn't that um good because like you can't go into full screen when you're going onto an app so basically what you do is you click onto you right click back onto a movie um what's it called iMovie and you click movie recording so now once you start a movie recording okay sorry i'm in the dark right now so sorry if you can't see me let me just actually let me just go and um, quickly turn my lights on okay basically what you have to do is you click a uh, movie recording so once you click movie recording oh wait let me just show you my dog yes if you didn't know this is my dog her name is Mia and she is a person Russian Terrier let me kiss you man. yeah okay there you can go you're free be free be free Mia, you can go. Don't just sit there. Okay, so anyways, if you wanna record your um your your face um along with your screen recording, you go along with your screen recording, but you also click movie recording. So when you click movie recording, it also goes into an audio recording, so then you don't have to do that if you want to. So once you do this, okay, so let me just bring Chrome, okay let's just do that and let's bring it here 
Okay, so as you can see, when I move Chrome around, it actually covers it. So then I have to click into that to do it. But then that's not very effective. So what I do is I go to view. Once I've clicked into this, I go to view and I click float on top. So once I do float on top, I can click into this app. And basically what it does is it basically allows this, this movie recording right here to stay on top of this app. Even though it it is not um even it is not um you're not in that in that app so but the drawback to this is so you I'm moving it here okay just the I'm just moving the screen recording here okay so the drawbacks to having um a face cam is that you can't go into full screen see like just now I just went into full screen and it um took away the um the face cam. So you have to be in small, um, small, what's it called, um, small screen. So you, so what I do is I just put a full screen, like I just, um, drag it like that for, um, yeah, what's it called for that. And so basically, um, that's basically the movie recording. You don't have to start the movie recording because you already have the screen recording on. So you don't have to do that. But anyways, that is basically for the movie recording. So that is all that I'm going to do for the movie recording. So, um, then again, if you want to do the movie recording, okay, um, you also have the option to save it. So let's just start a quick recording. Let's go. Okay. So that's it. That is also how your screen recording will come. Okay. So then you click the red button or you can just watch a video and then click the red button to see if it's nice. Then let's just export as something XD. Okay. So then you can uh, show which folder you want to save it to. I'm going to save it in um, downloads. But you can also don't save it or save it. So I'm going to do don't save because I don't want extra um, files on my laptop. But as you can see, I have a Madara Uchiha um, what's it called? background. Because if you're an Naruto fan like me, you would understand who he is. But I'm an Naruto fan and I personally like Naruto. So I have all Naruto backgrounds so anyways let's get so that is basically no blah, 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 I don't know what to say but anyways okay. so basically what and that is basically how I record my screen just in case you were wondering I'm pretty sure you already know how to use quick time player there are many more um, screen recorder apps but I think most of them cost money so I would suggest so if you are a beginner I suggest and you're starting gaming I suggest you use quick time I mean quick time player so like I just showed you how to do that so that is basically all and um, I hope you enjoyed if you if this video did help you out please don't forget to drop a like and don't click the dislike because that's just a bad zone but anyways um just um click the like button if this helped you and if you have subscribed turned on notifications and like this video um comment down below hashtag sky squad both s's are capital and i will try and give you a post notification shout out in my next video so anyways that is all from me i'll see you guys later peace out goodbye <laughs>